everybody, oh, my name's Chris, and welcome back to another exciting episode of Let's Play Terraria. In the last episode, I was digging out this meteor, and this is what the, the area looks like after I've done everything. And as you see, I, in the last episode, I said, I'm not going to place the, uh, the meteors down the ground, because that would be silly. Alright, stop that. Stop that. But, uh, yeah, as you can see, I got a lot of banners. Four, in fact. That means I killed 250 meteor heads in the midst of doing, um, in the midst of mining out all this meteor. And I died, at, well, I stopped dying at a certain point. Purple slime, wow, what's a purple slime? I'm actually kind of, you know what? I was, I was gonna just go back to the house and use a magic mirror, but I believe we're actually super close to, uh, where do we see it? Literally, yeah. Well, we have a bit of a walk. Not very far, though. Yeah, we really don't have that far of a walk at all. So let's go take a look at the what the edge of the, this side of the world looks like. In between episodes, I've done a lot of research. I was kind of tired of just wandering around, having no idea what the heck to do. Ooh, another corruption, I see. So if I un understand correctly, um, there's two different sides of the... Ooh, that could have hurt. There's two different sides of the world here. I'm a little bit worried of monsters. A monster's hurt my life, livelihood. Well, I hear evil things walking a boot. Um, but yeah, I've done a crap ton of uh, research since I've seen you guys last. Uh, I now know how to make grappling hooks. Well, kind of. I'm a bit confused on where to get the... Uh... I know I, there's been chains I've been making. Which, duh, that obviously makes the uh, grappling hooks. But another thing I've come up... I, I I got confused about was was the uh, ch uh was the hooks because apparently skeletons have like a one in uh like a like a two percent chance of drop or maybe actually I'm pretty sure it's actually decently high so I don't know why I'm having such a hard time uh yeah yeah take the damage I don't care I don't know why I'm having such a hard time um gaining the ability. Or getting the shot. Unless I already have like a hook and I just either threw it away like a stupid dummy or I uh, just have it in a chest somewhere. So I'll have to go take a look at that. I don't think I do have it in a chest though because I feel like I would have. I, I feel like I'd remember that if I did. Um, I also know how to summon the first couple bosses actually. Uh, let's see here. Oh, the Brain of Cthulhu. That, that's an obvious one. But there's actually a way to summon it without having to. Oh man, this is going to be. This is going to be an awkward steppy staff. Brave Cthulhu, you don't have to always you don't have to go and destroy those hearts all the time. You can just um craft an item and eat it or use it. So I know how to craft that so I don't have to fight underground. The Eye of Cthulhu, which is gonna be the first boss I'll be fighting, I know how to do that. Actually, I actually have two options to do that. I could either get 200 HP and then there's a one in three chance every night of it spawning. Like that's actually a pretty high chance to be honest. But uh or I could craft like some kind of lens thing at a crimson altar, which I do once again. I have I have the instructions of how to craft it. And I know you need the, like the crimson altars I've been seeing hanging in a booth and stuff. But uh, and uh, there's one other boss. Um, I do know also that uh, pretty much in order to get the next upgrade of pickaxe, I must. Woo! Oh man, oh boy. To get the next level of pickaxe, it's, it's, it makes the most sense for me to uh, kill the Brain of Cthulhu. Actually, I think that is definitely the, like, the next level of pickaxe for me. So, I guess that's going to be my next red cactus. Interesting. We're just going to leave that buddy there for now. I think this might be ore because I was actually looking and it was talking about special kinds of ore. Wow, that's weird. There's a spot just dug out there. But, uh, yeah, I was just going to craft a lens to summon the I have Cthulhu, but I'm really close to, ah, the edge of the world. This is the dungeon side. Let's see. Whoa, that looks like odd, man. Interesting. Oh, a lot of monies. I'm a little bit scared I'm going to hurt you, sir. So I'm just going to come back at night if you wish to enter. Okay, good. I didn't hurt him. <laughs> a little bit worried about that. Um... I'm entering. The world continues after this? What? From what I remember, Tabuscus world. I thought it ended at at the temple. Interesting. That's cool. Now let's go down a little bit here. What's that? A little 
Is that really not? Okay. I had to left or right click it for some reason. Weird. I'm not going to go too deep in here. That's ah, a light right there. Give me that potion. Also, now I don't know how to create potions. Um, I can literally just place an empty bottle. It creates like a crafting table, essentially. <coughs> oh, boy. Oh, my God. Chris is flailing about with finally stopped by the dungeon. Go okay, I don't think I'm going to be able to get that stuff back. Um. Well, that's annoying. <sighs> Rip in peace, my money. You don't lose all your money when you die, right? Hey, you just lose some of it. All right. Um, I was actually going to deposit my money before. But freaking Ralph was in the way, and I couldn't click on the freaking piggy bank because Ralph was standing in front of it, and he wouldn't freaking move. Oh, of course, now he moves. Um, yeah. Uh, the grand total of meteor head mine was 364. That is a freaking lot, man. That is insane. Uh, what's that? What? Can't make. No point in creating mana crystals anymore. How can I? What? Was it just not standing close enough? Oh, there we go, right there. Right there! Ah! Uh, I just shift click? No, I gotta freaking click myself. So I could make all the OP armor now. I don't think there's a point in leaving any of this. <laughs> I maxed out a stack, that's funny. What is this? Me a bar as well, cool. Uh, so I, another thing I also learned is that that's not the only meteor that's gonna happen. It does randomly happen, so it's not like it's only a one-time thing. Um, space gun. Use seven mana. Okay. I was gonna say I didn't just freaking mess it up, did I? I was gonna say that better not be as far as it goes. That's pretty good. How quickly is my mana restore? Wow, pretty dang quickly actually. Okay, what else could we create here? Meteor helmet, which I will place on there. And uh, I think what I'm gonna do, <coughs> <coughs> whenever I'm mining, I'll just switch out the, switch it out for my equipment. But since I'm not mining right now, there's kind of no point, right? Um, I already have, yeah, I already have the boots and the meteor suit. And I'm gonna be freaking awesome. Everyone's gonna be a freaking fan of me. Everyone's gonna love me. Anything else I could do? Uh, meter hammocks. Uh, 100 axe power, 60% hammer power. I should actually have looked at what my current stuff was first. 50% axe power. Holy, 100% axe power. That is much better. 45% uh, hammer power. 6% hammer power. What is... Oh, okay. So that, the rest of it is just stuff I don't really care about. Uh, there was a way to make... Oh, you know what? Lightsabers require... On. How do you? Oh wait, yeah, I gotta talk to Scott. Where where did Scott go? Scott, where the heck? Oh, there he is. God damn, Scott, what are you doing out here, you crazy guy? What are you doing? Greetings, Chris. Is something I can help you with? Yeah, there is. Show me what I could do with grave markers. Yeah, oh. <laughs> it was worth a try. Um, hasty shackle. Hmm. Is that maybe I could use that to make? No, that wouldn't make sense. Uh, where is it? Where's my bars? There's my those are my bras. Uh, emerald. Yeah, you require gems, which I don't really have. It's unfortunate. So I'll have to uh, do that later. There's this crap. I don't know what this drill containment unit is. So there's a writable drill. Oh, that's what it does. All right. Soul of Light. Uh, another, another, another thing I discovered is the fact that I will be able to actually change this world into a hard mode. It actually activates after I kill a certain boss, I think. Uh, so that'll be really cool. I'm very excited for that. <coughs> let's uh, let us do the following. Where's my? How do I? Oh, there we go. That's what I was looking for. Uh huh. I need like a star chest as well. There's also a star cannon I can make with meteorite bars, I know. 
I carry that for now. What are you? What are you do? What are you doing, Bofton? Can't go outside. Are you crazy, dude? Are you crazy? You should be. Uh, gravestone. Just my gravestone box, apparently. Guess I don't really need this bow and arrow anymore. Dang, 22 magic? I thought it was 20. Extremely weak knockback. Actually, I didn't knock back. I'm happy with, to be fair. Minus 50% speed, minus 10% velocity. Oh, I get because it's a little thawed thick. I don't know why I said it like that for. Alright, Rel, if I want to sell you some things. Oh, it's got a kid like you is standing between us and the, and the Cthulhu's eye. That's adorable. Hmm. How much of these was? Seven. Holy! Seven gold, 70 silver. Good lord. How many bars do I have still? Did I have two stacks? Okay, apparently not. Well, I guess I'll keep that. A lot of glow sticks. I guess we don't... Well... I guess we definitely don't need that anymore. That we don't need... We really need to deposit gold coin nine. Jeez, man. Jeez. We could get a lot of freaking money for that. I don't really... Maybe when I need money, I'll sell it. <clears throat> don't really need that anymore. Oh, we actually sell you. That's interesting. I don't think these these uh these stack to be honest, so I guess I'll sell them. Cause I noticed that I kept like placing those banners when I was killing meteor heads, and my damage remained the same after I placed like compared to when I placed the first one and the second one. So pretty sure it's fine unless you could combine them somehow, but I don't think so. And if I can, I'm an idiot. I have a lot of bombs. That's good. That's good. That's good. I guess that's really it. No. So might as well sell our stuff we don't really need, right? Heck, we don't need that crap no moles. No mo no. Whoa, how can I have 21? I thought I could only carry 20 at a time of those. Let's see if I have a hook. Um, maybe we should check chests. I don't have anything in. Good place. That in there. Have some seeds. How come that didn't stack when I go oh, whatever? Healing potion. I'll put that there. As I mean, those are gonna probably use for for crafting potions, right? I would imagine. So I'll place those in there. Platinum ore. It's the same chest. Same chest every day. Vertebrae. I know you use this to create some kind of boss summoning equipment. I have my nodes right beside me. I just don't have a point to using it quite yet. Where my potion chest go? There it is. All right, my ore's chest, my whore's chest. Cool. All right, this would be the chest that I might have. I have 11 lenses. I could definitely make, I could definitely summon the uh, Eye of Cthulhu at this point. Where's this crimstone block? That's right. Eskimo, sticky grenade. <laughs> Could probably sell all these weapons too to be honest i'll keep this for now <coughs> this hammock actually is a pretty cool idea okay so i guess i don't have it then hmm all right well i'm not gonna be stupid and go back and try to get my golden stuff because i know that guardian head um is probably something that will always instantly kill me until i do this thing i don't know what this thing is but it's a thing Pew! I also know how to find Sky Islands. I need to go to, uh, because I'm on a, a large world, it's going to be in between, oh, snap, insta-kill. Um, I'm going to be able to, ah, uh, crap. I'm going to have to go up in the sky 800 to 1,000 feet to be able to find it. I'm at 200 feet right now. So, that's a thing. Ah, I wonder if we go up these trees. I wonder if there's anything up these trees, actually. Somehow doubt it to be honest, but I don't know. Possible. Ooh, I should actually take out some trees while I'm here to be honest. Oh, so fast. Oh, so fast. So furious. So I might actually just go mining for a bit longer and see if I could get any. Uh, get 200 hearts because I feel like that would almost be more fun to just kind of randomly have the Eye of Cthulhu spawn instead of. Um, spawn it myself because then I'll be kind of like unprepared and it'd be like, ah, I'd be all crazy and stuff, you know. 
Oh my god, that's awesome. Oh my god. Burn, baby, burn. I love how the laser shots go through them. That's pretty gosh dang cool. So I guess I'm not going to be going mining. I'll do this. 25 defense. When does it switch? 21 defense. Okay, I see. Oh, I'm on fire! Brr. Damn, holy crap. That's so cool. This doesn't even use any ammo. Oh, there's a mana crystal. That's cool. What is that noise? Is that for me walking? I don't think so. Is that some kind of enemy? Is that the enemy that throws blocks at me? Very well could be. I don't seem to use that many torches when I'm uh, going underground. It is! Um, could you make a really cool bridge? <laughs> I'm also pretty sure these, these worm things also drop some cool stuff. This okay. I'm going to be very careful because if I fall... There you go. Bam! See, this is cool because I'm not even using like any ammo. Versus uh, that gun I was using that was obviously using bullets and are kind of expensive to use. And oh, I think it makes a yeah, it makes a cute noise when I'm uh, maxed out mana. And that's cool. Now that I'm using mana-based stuff that is dropping. It's dropping mana crystals for me to pick up. Or not crystals, but you know. Like, you know, when it drops hearts. This... Oh, this produces light because I'm a meteor man. That's cool. So I don't even need my mining helmet. I just totally upgrade my armor again. Pew, pew. Pew, pew. Get the sunlight giving off light. Alright, we need to find a new cave. Aha! Get out of here. Also told the uh, the purple slimes will in due time. I don't know the purple. I'll I'll in due time run into the uh, Sir Master King King Slime. Yeah, that dude guy. I don't even need to use this enhanced boomerang at all anymore. Is there, is there any point? Is there any point going down here at all? I don't know, man. It doesn't. That doesn't naturally turn to a cave, so let's not stick around. Let's just. I'm sure. Let's just keep walking until we find a cave. You know what? Let's let's do this. So, chances are, I'm not going to be using my boomerang much longer anymore. It'll be a backup for when I in, in like. Because I'm definitely at this point gonna overkill my gun. But even so, like I just shot that so many times, and I was only down like ten mana. <laughs> Also, I need better aim. Yeah, plus everything's gonna be dropping mana crystals now, which is really cool. Get out of here! Drop a hook. I need something to drop a hook. Yeah. It's like four shots kill those guys, though, which is kind of a bit annoying. Uh huh. Uh huh. Demon Eye, which, whoa, that was like 74 HP or something. There's like water breathing potions and all that I know I could get as well. Oh boy, Torch, Mining Potion, Recall Potion, I don't really care about that. I wonder, I'll get some salt though. Iron Bar, Hurt Big, Intrepid Radar, Detects Enemies Around, oh, that is the same thing I have. Sorry, I'm scratching my arm, I'm scratching my arm. Oops. I want the glow sticks, silly Billy. Uh, Hamax? Alright, pickaxe. Always forget which does what. I mean, you could walk through chest so you'd think that, hey, surely that's got to be a, uh, a background item, but apparently not. Game's stupid. Stupid. Oh boy, the entire cave's flooded out. Not a fan of that. Let me tell you one thing. <coughs> it's the fact that I'm not a fan of it. Boom! Um, glow stick. Where? There, glow stick. So toss that in there for now. Oh boy! 
All right, see what we can find. All right, start digging out. Oh, oh, there's actually a breathy, breathy hole right there. Yay! Oh boy, I, I'm not a fan of underwater caves at all, actually. As crazy as that sounds. Another breathy, breathy hole. Breathy, breathy hole! I think this is actually a cave right here. No! It's annoying trying to switch items, because if you're already using an item and you press the switch, it doesn't just switch it out. If you're using it, it doesn't let you switch. No, get out of here. Oh, crap. Woo! I believe this turns into a cave down here, so... Or so, I think. Although, I probably... You know what? Let's do this. Let's do this much more smartly, okay? I'll do that. Oh, boy. I'm still not doing it very smartly. <laughs> Stupid music. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. There we go. I just do this real quick, like. Ah. Uh, gotta collect some delicious, delicious tin. Oh, I think this brings it to the cave right now. Here, anyways. Or not. Or naw. Be like my little... Oh, that's not... There's no background there anymore. I thought there was. <laughs> Just shoot your gun a few times. It'll be fine. I don't want that stupid tin. Sick of it. And I'm happy with how quickly this pickaxe tears through dirt. Guys, remember the days way back when? Where it took forever to mine anything. Even dirt. Yeah. Good times. Good times. All right. I think this is going to break into a cave in a second. Or so I pray. Oh my god. Give me cave. Give me cave. Give me freaking cave. I want a freaking cave. Cave? This is leading to something, I hope. Aha! Cave. Cave. Yeah, cave. <laughs> Look at that! First thing I see. What do you think you're doing? Get out of here! Good lord. Think you're all tough and stuff. Uh, I really do got end off the episode though. Yeah. Let, let us consume it. Nom 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 nom. <gasps> Twenty. Oh. Wait, we do have 200 life now. I forgot each of these. Oh, crap. I didn't realize we only need one. Okay, so it should tell me a message when uh, Cthulhu spawns. That's awesome. Uh, anyways. Oh, in the complete darkness. Let's place a torch. In the complete almost darkness. Uh, I'm going to end off the episode. Thank you guys so very much for watching. If you enjoyed, the best way to support me is by leaving a like and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Uh, in the next one. We, we'll check out a bit more of this cave, I guess. And hopefully, we'll go back. We'll go home as soon as the Eye of Cthulhu. As soon as I get a message saying the Eye of Cthulhu has spawned. So, yeah. See you guys later. Bye.